and here we are with a new Once Human video. On October 17th, the brand new scenario, The Way of Winter, was released, bringing a new map area, Nalcots North. To mark this occasion, I'm here to give you five essential tips to help you tackle the way of winter and its challenges. These are things I realized after first landing on the island, and fortunately, you can still take some vital resources with you from Manibus, thanks to the option of carrying over certain key items during the transition between scenarios. You won't be able to take much, but trust me, you don't want to miss these. Let's dive in. 1. Logging Beaver If you haven't found it while chopping trees, the logging beaver is a fun deviation that helps you cut trees and build faster. If you haven't discovered it yet, instead of clearing an entire area, just head to the second city, Myers Market, which can be found in the Manibus scenario. By following the path shown here, you'll find it near the dock. It's easy to capture, and this resource will be invaluable. 2. Lethal Rabbit This is another deviation you can find by hunting rabbits. Why should you do this on Manibus? Because the spot on the map is filled with rabbits. Within about 25 minutes of hunting, you can find this deviation. You need to collect the pelts after each kill, but be careful. Don't kill too many at once. Take down about three or four so that the others don't run away. As you'll see, the deviation will appear, and you can take it. Bonus tip. After capturing it, I found another logging beaver under the same dock, so you can take that one too. 3. Electric Eel This deviation is also easy to find. Just buy mint bait from a vendor, who also sells some other cool stuff. Start fishing, and you'll soon catch an electric eel. This gives a 40% electric bonus to your structures which is super useful when you're setting up solar panels in the new scenario since you won't have many resources at the start. It makes managing your power needs much simpler. 4. Grow Shroom Green Touch This deviation, called Grow Shroom Green Touch, will take care of all your plant's needs. It's pretty straightforward to find, though it requires a bit of effort. You just need to collect as many mushrooms as possible before leaving Manibus, and after a while, like with the rabbit deviation, it will appear. Once you've got it, you can focus on exploration without worrying about tending to your plants. 5. Fetch a Lot Bunny This is another deviation that I highly recommend bringing with you to the new server. It will help you gather plants, which are crucial in this map, especially to stay warm by eating them. It's incredibly important for survival. Finding it is simple. Head to a giant tree in a specific location on the map. It's hard to miss because it's huge. After hitting it a few times, the deviation will appear, and you can capture it. If, like me, you have trouble getting it on your first try, just open the menu, go to Eternal End, and then return to try again. It should reappear, and you can start hitting it again. 6. Flame Essence and here's the sixth and final tip, or is it? Anyway, it's about bringing another deviation from Manibus called Flame Essence. This deviation is easy to locate, but tricky to capture. You'll first need to go to a factory to try to catch it. If it escapes the first time, don't worry. You'll unlock three additional locations where it might appear. If you fail at the first location, head to the next spot, on top of a roller. If it evades you again, you can find it by following these train tracks to a massive electrical tower. If you still can't capture it there, try the third location in another factory, where it should appear near the end. If you're still unlucky, return to the first location, where you'll now have another chance to catch it. Good luck. This deviation will be incredibly helpful when smelting all the materials your Digby boys bring home, or that you collect yourself with the help of the next tip. Bonus tips. If you've already unlocked the electric drill and chainsaw in Manibus, make sure to bring them along. They'll make it much easier to gather trees and rocks early on, giving you quick access to crucial materials. After talking to your first companion, Marsley, head to a spot near her camp to quickly gather resources. 
This is a fast way to dismantle things, take your first steps, and, most importantly, unlock the motorbike. It's provided without the need to build it, so you'll be able to move around safely and quickly right away. Finally, when Lo gives you the mission to collect the Digby boy at Igloo Camp, don't talk to him right away after completing it. Wait and return later, or use a teleport to find another Digby boy. You can have two or more of these helpful creatures, especially if you didn't have enough inventory space during the server transition to carry one over fully leveled up. These little helpers are great for gathering nearby rocks, and having an extra one can be really beneficial. Now that you've got all these tips, you're ready to start your adventure in the new scenario.